You have reached Atheist Republic voicemails. God may not be listening to you, but the citizens of the Atheist Republic are. Leave us a voicemail on AtheistRepublic.com for a chance to have your message broadcast to our followers worldwide. Send us your opinions, stories, advice, or concerns. Together, we'll build a platform for Atheist voices all around the globe. Hello there, Atheist Republic. Another atheist here. I was raised as a Hindu. But now I'm a completely hardcore atheist. Never knew that your site existed until I stumbled upon it yesterday. Your site has been banned here by the Hindu nationalist government. But my VPN managed to get me here. On that site I saw some of your brilliant blasphemous artworks. And then got particularly attracted by the lesbian picture depicting Kali and Sita. I enjoyed it. Then on YouTube I heard that many people were complaining that you got biased. But I think it's not. And I don't even care if you are or not. Uh, finally, just keep doing your work. I'm liking it and just keep smacking those religious fanatics. I really admire this community because it tells me that I'm not alone. This Republic. Hello, oh, how are you doing, everybody? Hello to all the pure atheists all over the world. This is Ahmed. I'm 24 years old. I'm from Egypt. Um, I would like to share my story about the religion and how I left Islam. My, my story starts when I was in the 18th, you know, I was in the last year of my secondary school. You know, while, while I was studying or playing football or watching movies or doing, I was enjoying my life. I was doing kind of a lot of stuff like all my friends doing. But, you know, I was a religion, religious mom, so as, you know, a lot of times I go to mosque, I pray. So, and that's, that's something like interrupt me and make me confused when I go to pray. And a lot of most, you know, a lot of my friends doesn't go to, to pray. And then I, I was studying and, you know, I'm go to go deep in the studying. Then I hear the event so i had to stop my studying and then go to pray and then go back and even if i'm playing i had to stop playing and go so and then i, I began to suspect you know what's the impact what's the effect of what all what i'm doing you know i'm i'm just i think i'm wasting my time go to pray uh five times a day and my friends doesn't doesn't do that and there's no difference you know we go to the lesson, there's no difference, you know. But I think they have advantage. They have like an hour a day, They an advantage, like they're playing, they're enjoying their time, they're studying. But uh, what I'm doing, I'm, I'm just wasting my time. I, I see there's no effect, you know. If I studied, I'll, be su I'll, I'll get success. If I don't, I'll get failed. So why I'm praying? That's came my thought and then I... I begin to know I see there's no effect for my praying. You know, if I started, I'll get success. That's it. So why I'm praying? I'm praying. I, I see there, there's nothing happen. Even for my friends, the friends who doesn't play, pray, they may be better than me or they have advantage than me. So that's why I began to suspect. And then after I finished um, my secondary school, I began thoughts, oh, and I are about to go to college, so I have a lot of more times. I, 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 will, I was born in rural area, so there's there's nothing called like, I don't even know there's anything called atheism, and there is no the people that don't believe in God is not, God is not exist. There are a lot of people like that, and all of, all of my friends or all of the area, I think most of the people around me have the same thing. So I began to, uh, I watched it, uh, suddenly I got videos, uh, I got a video for an atheist, an ex-Muslim uh, on YouTube, criticized Islam, 
And then I began, oh, what the hell? What are you doing? What do you say? I got shocked in the first and I, I got afraid. I closed that. So then I, I got back. Um, After a while, I got back and watched the videos. I, I began to search after him. I began to watch it, uh, people to reply for him. And I, I think I think the replies you, it doesn't make sense at all for me. Um, and after that, I was I was asking myself, what if I was born in China? What if I was born in somewhere else like USA and Japan? Or what if even I, I was born in Iraq? I'll be I'll be a Shia, I'll be a Muslim, but not Sunni. And there's a hadith called there's um, the Muslim will be divided to seventy three tribes and one tribe will be go to go to go to the heaven and the rest will go to the hell oh da oh what the huh? so what oh i was so lucky that i was born muslim but i have to figure out which tribe i'll go to to be to go to the heaven and then after searching and after watching watching videos and search after that I got 100% that Islam is fake and there's no religion and there's no God. God but the mean he will punish you and there's nothing after death. And I choose to take the harder tool rather than the easy illusion. And then here is I'm 24 and I am like I'm an asset from six years ago. And even there in, in the Islam, there is no free will. That's all. That's all. Thank you for your time. Thank you all for listening. Have a pleasant day. Hi, this is Bernardo Torres or Bernie Torres. I just like to thank you for a lot of information by reading that book, why there's no God, that I actually get the the shirt. Always question. Question everything. Do a good job, guys. Thank you. Hi, I am Sandeep, and my nickname is Sandy SS, and I am an atheist and a proud atheist because I don't love God and I don't want the word God in my life. I, the word God or Allah or any words like Devi, Devtas in India are nothing to me. They are useless things. I am a human being by nature and I want to be a human only, not a God's creature. Because God creates nothing. It creates confusions. It creates differentiations. And it creates hate. Please consider supporting us by sharing the podcast with your fellow heathens or donating by going to AtheistRepublic.com and clicking on support. Subscribe to Atheist Republic voicemails on iTunes, Stitcher, or your favorite podcast app. And please leave us a review.